Hola mga Lakers! Welcome back! If you're new to my channel, my name is Sir Kevin. I love to share my skills and knowledge about educational technology. I upload before twice and now four times a week. So if you want to learn more about educational technology, subscribe now and hit that notification bell so you will be updated on my latest video. We are now on episode 4. If you want to check the previous episodes, click the caption above. I made series of videos for me to show you how you can use Kotobi Author and Kotobi Reader. For this video, I'm gonna show you how you can add images and audio. Let's start with image first. Before you insert an image, make sure you click the spot where you place your image. If you are done, let's click this image button. Then click add image. Locate your image in your local file. Note that you can only upload one image. When it comes to image format, you can upload JPEG, a PNG, and GIF. It is also known as the animated image. For the configuration, if you let the width and height in auto, the actual size of the image will appear. If you want to resize the image, let me give you a reference what image looks like with corresponding size in pixels. I have here from 50 by 50 pixels going down or should I say going up to the 500 by 500 pixels. If the position of the image is reflowable, you have three options under text wrap. None, push left, and push right. If you choose none, the image will be placed on the center of the page. Push left, place on the left. And push right, place on the right. If the position of the image is fixed, you can place the image anywhere on the page but it is on top of the text and not compatible with reflowable layout or it stays only on the spot where it is placed meaning to say it is not recommended for reflowable layout let's check the preview to do that click the customize tab then choose a platform wait the emulator to load then now you can navigate you can also rotate the device for different orientation
To add audio, click the audio button. Then you have two options. One is linking an mp3 file using a URL link or upload mp3 file from your computer. For this demonstration, I choose add audio file. Let me locate the audio from my file and note that only mp3 format is acceptable. Any other format is not applicable. Click open to upload. You can also check autoplay. It will play automatically when the page is open. And that sounds great. So let's click this one. Then click create to attach. Let's check preview to listen to the audio file. A patch cable is a general term for cabling that connects two electronic devices to each other, typically in a network. These devices might include computers and other hardware. Patch cables are also used to carry telephone. If you know how to add images and audio, you can now create a storytelling book. Perfect for your student who loves storytelling. For the next episode, if this video helps you a lot, give a like and share to the people you think who needs to see it. Thank you for watching and I am Sir Kevin. See you on my next video.